And so the battlefield against the CCP is not in Beijing, Shanghai, or even Hong Kong, South China Sea. No, it's right here in the United States of America because the CCP has spent decades of time and effort carefully infiltrating and influence in this country. So what do you know about CCP's infiltration in this country besides the invasion of the CCP spy balloon? Well, I, I happen to know that the whole pandemic, this whole uh, virus, yeah. was intentionally released by the Chinese on America. You say intention? Intentionally. I mean, we've gone over three years. We've crawled with getting more information. Originally, it was some kind of pangolin in a wet market. It was all nonsense, supported by Fauci and other, um, the World Health Organization and National Institutes of Health. Um, the bottom line is that China used the virus to try to destroy America. They wanted to destroy our economy. They wanted to destroy President Trump. That was the most important thing to them. Uh, President Xi was made to look like a fool by President Trump. Uh, he manhandled him on the tariffs. He kept him at bay. Uh, President Xi would have never even considered going into Taiwan, much less supporting Russia and the Ukraine, if President Trump was still president. Um, so President Xi's first move in uh, probably about August 2019. I started writing about it in November of 2019. They said, we have this virus, we could release it on them, we can destroy their economy, we'll get Trump out of office, and all of a sudden everything will be okay with us in America again. That's what they decided to do. Wow. You know what? Talking about the pandemic, um, a few days ago, uh, the FBI director Christopher Wray and the U.S. government uh, formed some kind of a consensus. They say this is a bio weapon, uh, a virus, leaked from the Wuhan lab, but it's accidental. And you're saying it's intentional. Why so? Well, it's intentional because President Xi and China couldn't allow President Trump to continue to walk all over them. And, you know, it's, 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 it's something that's just, um, it's just unacceptable. And it, this is a battle for the mind of the Americans. And so people have to wake up. Sensible people understood not to get this vaccination. The second step of the virus and the release of it in the United States is the vaccinations. And you think President Xi is getting vaccinated with Pfizer's vaccine? Uh-uh. Not going to happen.